So you brought in an amazing collection that belonged for your dad of John Wayne memorabilia. He met John Wayne back in the early 40s and he got into the movie business after he was a bartender and maitre d' at some restaurants in Los Angeles and started out as a bit player and worked his way up to, finally to an assistant director. And I do believe once he actually got to be a director of a second unit film for a day or something, so maybe he was a director for a day. Ah. So we have this wonderful picture of John Wayne. Unfortunately, we don't have a picture of your dad. Well, I think it's like 1952 or 53, and I do believe the movie was Jet Pilot, which was not released for several years after it was made for some reason. And with him are the uh, Kerr family from Oklahoma. It was Kerr McGee Oil. They were the Kerr part. And I believe one of them was the senator uh, from Oklahoma. And I remember going down and meeting him. You met John Wayne? Many times, yes. Uh, ever since I can remember as a four-year-old kid, we used to go over to his house, which, is, which was then in Sherman Oaks, and uh, later on uh, when he had a house in Encino, yes. And he was a very, very friendly and very nice gentleman. This picture is good because in 1952, it was exactly the time that he started his own production company, yes. Bat Jack. Right. And that is the company that your dad worked for. Yes. We often get memorabilia from those movies, mm -hmm. things uh, that John Wayne wore, but we never really come across paper ephemera mm -hmm. because most of it was just destroyed during yes. the, the meanwhile. What you have is really interesting. They are the original cast sheets from each of these movies, and you have practically 16 or 17 movies, which is just yes. fantastic. It, lists the, the star, the character, and um, their personal information, and then an agent if they had one. Mm -hmm. It's really a great snapshot of that particular movie and that particular time. So in that large stack of paperwork that you brought to me, uh, we took out these specific pieces. It's just a sampling of what you have. Yes. We feel that they would bring five to seven hundred each, maybe a little more for some films. So about fifteen hundred to two thousand for just what we see here. But you have sixteen or seventeen of them. So yes. that adds up quite a bit. Yes, the photograph is wonderful. The photographs of John Wayne are very collectible and these normally bring between a hundred and fifty to two hundred dollars. Oh really thank you.